Hi, today we're looking at how using customer photos can really drive trust on social media. This is the Rudding Park Hotel and it's in Harrogate and it's a spa break destination. They excel at showing off the natural beauty and relaxing environment of the surrounding area and of course lots of fun things that are happening around Harrogate. However, they regularly use um, imagery from previous guests, which is a great way to not only recognise the previous guests, but they can build on peer-to-peer -peer recommendations. As you can see, this one has got some user-generated content, as we like to call it. So this lady has obviously been at the spa, had her picture taken, tagged them in, and they reused the image here. As you go further down, this might be one of theirs, or from a guest, as you can see, there's someone sitting opposite. So it will just be someone that's tagged them in. And again here, someone sitting enjoying the um, hot tub. So this all shows us what an amazing experience it is to be at the Rudding Park Hotel. And what they've done is they've reworked the content and they've said, it's been a while since we released any spa day, but it's their fifth birthday. So um, these are all the dates that you can book. This is how much it is. This is what they can do. Here's all the links. And then of course they've, they've tagged in all of the customers um, that actually generated this content. So what that's done is it's thanked the customers for tagging them. It's thanked them for any reviews. It's showing what it's really like um, in the, at their actual destination. And it gives a real trust and authenticity to it. And it makes you think, oh, I want to be that girl drinking that champagne or I want to be having that brunch, for example. But any business can do this. So whenever any customer tags you in, make sure that you repurpose the content, you take the post, you, re you reshare it, and then you can do it again later down the line if it's applicable to a particular thing as well. Now, if I was the Rudding Park Hotel, I would want to be understanding what's working, what's not. So if that was one of my best posts, I'd want to be thinking, hmm, how can I do more of that? So I would go to my maybe dashboard and on the maybe dashboard, it tells me this is my content. This is the number of posts that I've got scheduled. And here I can literally schedule in my content. It tells me um, how many people are commenting on my post. Therefore, I can go back and, um, and reply to them. It tells me how many people are talking about me or tagging me in. And then it also tells me um, different conversations. So if anyone, like any of those previous guests have um, tagged me in before or talked about me before, I can go back in and see their, their content and I can go in and like it, I can share it and I can support them as well. And as you can see, then you can start going further down that they can look at whatever their best post was for that week. And if they start to see that it's the same, you know, guest type of images, then they can do more of that. And then they can even compare themselves to another spa destination and see what, you know, which, which post works better for them. Is it Facebook? Is it Instagram? What can we learn from? And then there's just so many other insights that they can get from the Maybe dashboard. If you've got any questions whatsoever, please use the little blue button. We love you.